They got two of these small entries into the uh, church and nativity. This one, and you go into the church there. But the lines are long. The problem with the uh, church and the nativity is that you got to wait in long line. So this guy here tells me he's going to get me around the long line for a few shekels. <laughs> Guiding, tour, explanation, everything, and visiting the birthplace. For 50 shekels. Over. It's you because you are alone, poor man. <laughs> but 50, not now, we have with the others. 50 people. shekels and I'll do it. As long, I don't care if you give me a guide, as long as I get around that line. Yeah, it's good you have the tour guide also with the church. <laughs> okay. 50 minutes explanation and put in the easy service we're doing here. Okay. I like being in Bethlehem, no pressure. You can just hang out. Jerusalem, I had too much pressure to see too many things I wanted to see. Here, I could just hang out and see what happens. Am I coming with you? Yeah. And we're, we don't have to wait in lines. That's, yeah, that's for sure. the main but issue. I them, no waiting in line because there is a long line inside the church. No wait three hours. Take okay. you immediately to the grotto. Okay, is sounds good. Is someone missing? So I'm joining this group here. So now we are going to the church of the nativity to see the perfect place just was But we have my colleague to see we just want to record video enjoy Okay? Colleague. I'm your colleague all of a sudden now. The Bible said Jesus was born in the stable and the Holy Family came back. They came from where? To Bethlehem from Nazareth. And the Virgin Mary gave it the birthplace in the manger there. So the, uh, there we are going to see the manger. The big prophet was the manger. Manger, we know, where is the manger? In the stable. Yep. That's the big prophet to believe Jesus was born in the stable. But about, what about the location? We took it by the people to people, mouth to mouth. When Helena came over here, huh? she didn't know, she met the early Christians. And the early Christians who are, were living in Bethlehem, were living in Bethlehem, you know, maybe the roots belong for the Jews or Judaism or pagan, they convert to Christianity. And they would secret town, secret point, you know, came here, huh? Huh? You see the birthplace. When came here, Elena she meet them and she give them freedom, free because the Christian even persecuted by the Romans at this moment. The, the, by Emperor Henry and all of them, they didn't allow any Christians to have free the Christians or Jews. Yeah. So when they came here, they asked the people and they named the people sure it was here to prove this. Talking mouth to mouth and still today people believe it was here. The church for security. And this was mentioned also from the Bible, the idol of the needle. Because Jesus spoke in something for the people. The camel, it is difficult to pass to throw the holy needle into kingdom of Jesus. But the re no, it is easy. But the man, the rich man, it will be hard for him. You understand? Yeah, and if the camel, the camel, 
it is easy to pass because the Kamali has poor heart, you know, and mind. It is to pass, like to kingdom of Jesus Christ or any kingdom. Huh? But the rich man, it's hard for him. Ah, so we made that. Yeah, Poor guy's convinced he can get us through the back door. I tried to go down those steps earlier. He wouldn't let me go, but that's because I don't know them. <laughs> so this tour guide says he's going to get us in the back door so we don't have to go through that incredibly long line, which is probably a good four-hour line. See if he can do it. It'll be worth whatever he charges. <laughs> oh... <laughs> See if he can pull off his magic, huh? Oh my goodness, that line is incredibly long. And it's like not single file, by the way. It's like a ball. This is the entrance to the grotto where Jesus was born. When you go down the stairs, you see the star. Huh? The birth of Jesus, I love, I love to see the manger. You are entering with those people. Who is on this? Here, here. Here? Ah, it's okay. Take that bottle. It's not here. It's good. if it was single farm but it's a ball of people even though we went around probably about two or three hours of uh, line okay so we're trying to get into the grotto but you only can go like one person at a time and we have to go by our our small little group here I almost feel like those you know when you got traffic and you got to merge into one lane and then someone comes around the other way, zooms right by you, almost feel like I'm that person or that group of people because we like zoom. Not even sure why I'm doing this. I've been here before and I'm not big on religious iconic places, but here I am. Yeah. Somehow our group all stay together here. We come different directions, but there's our group. Good. Good. <laughs> This is the birthplace, and other side is the manger. So, this is the scrotto. This is the point where they say the manger was. And of course, uh, it's through word of mouth. Like you said, tradition over the years, people believe something and they pass it on to the next. Where Jesus was born, and then they, and they put him down here where the manger is. So that's that's the uh, site of the manger. Right here. This is supposedly the manger. I keep using words like supposedly. Sorry about that, but you know. It's all word of mouth that these are the right places. Yeah, it's okay. Okay, so this is the Greek Orthodox one here. And this is the Armenian. They just got a little chapel here. And then the Catholic Church has got one on the other side I was at yesterday. Interesting, the group that I'm with are Muslims, but yet they 
believe more in those like yeah. things than I do. The, big difference the uh, Islam. sites, they were kissing them and stuff. It is the faith. 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 But we believe Jesus was born by Holy Spirit. Okay, okay. You understand? I understand. Yes. Judaism, no, they are still waiting. Odds and, yeah, go ahead. In Hinduism, the basic idea is that that we believe in incarnation. Some of the gods, they take themselves as a human being. Okay. As their uh, avatar. How is this different than what I just explained to you about Christians believing in Jesus? So these are the, uh, almost we can say something like different, uh, it's not that the, Indian, uh, the Hinduism and Christianity are different. Christianity, what I believe is that they take in birth. Similarly, the God from the, uh, I mean, superior God, they take birth in a, uh, a condition of the avatar. Right. That the avatar is called Ram, Krishna, and these are the gods, they are demigods that you can say. There is an avatar of the demigods, yeah. Demigods. Yeah, the difference, of course, is in Christianity, yes, yes. we just believe in the one God, yeah. the Father. But and the, the, like I was saying, the sin, yeah, yeah. The, the, the argument is between the creator and his creation. Yes, yes. And the only way that could be resolved is he becoming his creation. Yes, so yes. he becomes man in order to take the punishment, punishment that man deserved. So in Hinduism, all in Prajini, Give me, I have a long Hindu. hand. Yeah, no. So here Hindu I am Muslim. taking a photograph. Christian, everybody together, please. Everybody here Romana, is either Romana, Hindu please, or please, move, Muslim. Move. That's what's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Move, move, move yeah, Moving all, okay. Move, move, move. Turn it, turn it. Turn it, turn it. 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 Thank you, Peter. Thank you, Peter.